Hey love bugs, it's Ross, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed, I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended family, thank you so much for the love and support. And just opening up yourselves to different knowledge that you need to, just to know about your gift, or just allowing yourself to be able to let go of things that has been holding you back and so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when i'm about to upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two i love to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me or even if it's about the content of the video or you're just telling me about your empathic the gift that's been placed upon you and how has it impacted your life. And if you feel like the video has been very informative to you, you know, give me a thumbs up. Share it with the next person you think that might need to, you know, hear the message. Or even share it on your social media favorites, wherever you see fit. And thank you so much for stopping by my channel today, and I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And this beautiful, relaxing music I am listening to today is get to sleep fast and easy healing sleep music at the deepest sleep 432 hertz of sleeping music and i will post that link in the description box below and the video today is about twin flame 101 hey okas we have to have that attitude of gratitude yes we have to have the attitude of gratitude i was listening to tammy Rowland. um i don't know if a lot of people know about her she plays on uh basketball wives and she has the the bonnet chronicles where she does you know she does these things on live instagram or whatever and she you know she just speaks the truth and it's like she made a valid point there could be there's times that you know we really don't appreciate the things that are in our lives and i know you might not have that car that perfect car that's up to date you know a 2000 you know a 2019 or you know or 2020 or whatever of uh, you have to be grateful for the things that are coming in your life you know i have to be blessed you know my car is not the best thing in the world but it gets me to point a to point b you know we complain about the houses we live in my house is falling apart but you know i got a roof over my head i have a place where i can go to sleep at there's some people that are like laying up under the bridge somewhere sleeping in cars you know don't even have a place to stay you know it's been raining outside and you think about you know we we don't humble ourselves for the things that we have in our lives. We have to be able to appreciate things. Even though it might not be the best things in the world, we have to be able to appreciate stuff like that. And a lot of us, we take that for granted. You know, there's a lot of times where we're like, oh, I'm so tired and this and this and that. But there's people out here that have terminal illnesses where they can't even, it's hard for them to take breaths. They probably can't even walk from the bathroom or from their bed without getting exhausted. You know, but yet we'll be talking about, oh, I'm so tired, oh, I'm so this. You know, we sit up here and complain about jobs when people out there don't even have jobs. You know, we have to be grateful for the things we have. You know, you don't like the jobs you have. Change them if you can. Change them. But we have to be grateful for each and everything that comes in our lives. It's just like you have to humble yourself because it can be a lot worse. You know, it really can. And I say that a lot. You know, I have to be grateful for things during my life. You know, I might not have not be exactly where I want to be right now, but I know I'm heading that way. You know, by doing my videos, putting out to the universe, I'm going to make it. I'm going to be that survivor. I'm going to be that team, whatever of positivity as I possibly can. You know, even though there might be days that I'd be weary or whatever, I have to thank God and just say, God, just be patient with me. You know, I know you have brought things to my life and I know you have taken things out of my life and some things I might not understand, but they're for your own benefit. So be grateful for the things that are coming into your life. And you know, if you're putting yourself in a better place, you know, know that the universe is going to set what they need to set for you. You know, if you're, you know, you're complaining about things and you're not actually putting in the work for it, you can't sit up there and complain about nothing if you're not trying to change it. So if there's things that you don't like about your life, we'll always have that possibility to change what we don't see fit that is in our lives. You can, you, you know, if you don't like your job, start looking for a different job that suits the things that you enjoy. You know, don't 
work just to work, you know, and sometimes it's hard to do that. But be grateful for the things that are coming into your life. Be grateful for the things that are being taken out of your life, especially when it comes to people. You know, sometimes we get so upset because, oh, this person left me or, oh, this person, you know, doesn't talk to me anymore. That is a blessing on your benefit. Because if they were meant to be in your lives, they would be there. You know, if you can't have people around you, that makes you unhappy. It makes you feel like you have to, you know, you have to sugarcoat stuff. Or you can't tell them this because they'll get upset because they don't want to see you happy. Anybody that is in your life that is a blessing to your life only wants best for you. And if there are some people out there that can't be happy for you and actually celebrate your happiness with you, please step away. <laughs> step away. I've had to have people out of my life and I had to take them out of my life because they would get jealous over certain things I was able to achieve even though they were able to achieve things I might not have been able to do everybody has their own talent everybody has their own technique everybody is unique in their own way so we can't sit up here and you know hate on somebody else's blessing or hate on somebody because they're able to do something that's better than you. Because there could be a, a certain thing that you're able to do that they're not able to do. So there's so many people that put each other down instead of lifting each other up. And we realize, we, sometimes it's hard to realize, we all can make it at finish line at the same time. So, you know, when you feel that you feel uncomfortable about certain things, you have that possibility of changing them. So I hope you were able to get something out of this message. Sorry it's so short. I missed y'all. You know, I was only gone for 24 hours. I said I was going to take two days off, and that usually doesn't happen because I was like, oh, my God, I'm ready to make some more videos. So I said, okay, you know, I'm going to go ahead and rest up. Sorry I'm just getting back to y'all's comments. You know, I usually, you know, answer them during the day, but I just, you know, stayed clear from YouTube today. You know, just to get a break, just to recharge, because I know I wouldn't have been able to do the things that I need to do to fix myself if I stayed on on social media like that. So I hope you were able to resonate with the video. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can, and knowing we are having better days. Know that you are blessed and highly favored and truly loved, and know there is always somebody out there praying for your better days. Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my video. Drop me a line, I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, or even if it's about the impact they give, or the positive feedback of the video. And I will see you later. And give me a thumbs up, like, and even share also. And I hope that everybody had a blessed Monday. And see you on my next video. Peace. Peace out.